First, it's wonderful to see you all here. Terrific. It, it almost feels like home. We were never, during the war, of course, there were very few of us, and we never stayed, therefore, in the town itself. We lived high up in the hills, and over to the right, and then further on that way, uh, past my array, which is just up there. That is our observation post. And we used to watch the Japanese troops here in this parade ground, hundreds of them doing their exercises. And they were quite well disciplined. They used to get out and do their exercises. Right and and to, the uh, <laughs> they were quite good at that, but they were not here for that reason. We used to, when there were not so many Japanese in this area, but sometimes they, they were camped down the road towards Bobanara. And we used to come down and make sure that we knew where every building was. And some of these buildings were not here then. They have been built since. But in the road that we just drove up in the car, on the left-hand side, if you look this way, there were, we had two men shot. One of them died. The other one was shot through the cheek. But the, our, our comrades carried him right up the hill, past I Ray, over that hill, towards <coughs> the road towards Mobisi. I might uh, add to it, we should thank you people. When that man, his name was uh, Sid Bell, and uh, he was carried up this track here by our criados and some other local Timorese men. Now, they didn't get any pay, they didn't get anything for that. They were just wonderful people. But unfortunately, he died up on that, on that ridge. From up on that hill, which is Iray, we used to watch the Japanese through Japanese binoculars. I mean, it's ridiculous, but we did. And we used to watch them parading here on the ground. And of course, we knew exactly what they were going to do to go to Bobanara, or back that way, or down this hill here. So it was valuable, and we used to transmit that information back to Australia by wireless. Yeah. That really describes our situation here. We didn't do any major shooting in this area, but we did on other parts of the hill. And over, as you climb halfway up towards Iray, we went to the right, and we camped in a village there which could not be seen from here, but we could look down on the road to Bobanara.